Hi, everyone is interested in their health and finding the best way to take care of themselves and be well and avoid the problems this country is plagued with. And if you're like most people, you want to avoid what is coming straight at you from your family history. My name is Dr. Peter Lind, and I'm going to give you some very, very refreshing, helpful information that will reduce or eliminate your symptoms and improve your health like you've never heard before. Now just sit back and get comfortable for the next few moments because these new health keys will make you upset because no one has told you this before and yet excited that you will be able to take action right now to improve your health condition however serious it is. Healthcare today is more expensive and messed up than any time in the history of the world. We have $30,000, $40,000, $50,000 surgeries that are bankrupting families. People you may know and be one who are taking liver-destroying drugs that come with multiple side effects that are having negligible positive effects. It's not better, it's worse. People younger and younger are becoming sicker and sicker. How long do you wait to pull the plug? Do you remember a time that seems a long ago when you were well or you felt well? How long ago was that? How far are you away from that right now? I mean, wasn't it nice to think or not worry about your health and what's going to happen? Take a quick memory trip with me back to the time when it went wrong. Does health deteriorate slowly like everyone's always does or change quickly like some people's does through a major trauma, a major stress? My guess is that our current healthcare system just allows you to deteriorate at a slower rate today than doing something now to improve it. I've got some happy news for you about what went wrong and what to do to get well right now that you won't get out of your mind. Just two major systems in your body that you already have that I'm wondering if they're terribly upset. We're going to find out why while I talk about your neurological system and your metabolic system. Here's what we're going to do. Number one, your brain may not firing right. So we're going to test it and see how your brain and nerves work. Today we have some pretty amazing tests we do to find this out. We will see just how you are doing. Many problems we find in the way your cerebellum talks to your cortex, or how many times your midbrain in your brainstem is overfiring like an uncorked champagne bottle, that's not a good thing. Your brain patterns need to be balanced. When we find a part of, at fault, you will have to supply the correct sequences of stimuli to each area of fault, and we will watch your nervous system unfold into health again. Many times your system is oxygen deprived. You're lacking oxygen, you could be anemic, you need oxygen to supply to your nerve system. It's really all about what we find wrong with you and what we can use to help your brain and nerve system heal again. Well, second is your metabolic system. This is the symphony of all your glands and organs working together, or how very few of them are working together. We are going to run functional metabolic laboratory tests so we can understand how your glands and organs are individually and if they are working in concert. This means a blood glucose test for hypoglycemia or insulin resistance, a lipid panel to see how angry your cholesterol and triglycerides are, kidney markers, liver markers, thyroid panels, serum calcium levels, check your iron levels. We're going to run over 60 blood chemistry markers, probably 50 more than you've ever had done at one time. Most doctors don't know they need to order these kinds of labs to find out what's been going on with you and why you're not well. Even if they do order these tests, they usually order a few measly tests. They usually order a few that your insurance company will approve of and only the ones that an insurance clerk considers medically necessary, which is why you're exactly in the spot you are right now which is why we order for you a thorough, comprehensive, functional metabolic laboratory panel that you won't get anywhere else. 
and won't be evaluated like we do. It's like this. You may have high normal lab results. They are still high. You may have low normal lab results. They are still low. We need to find out why these are high and low. And here's the thing you can remember. All your results are evaluated functionally, not pathologically. I am looking at you in a functional model, not in a disease model, like you're used to being treated. This is what will make a difference between you gaining your health or continuing managing your disease. It makes no sense to have a pathologically trained doctor look at these because they'll find nothing wrong until there's pathology. You don't want to wait that long. You get dysfunction before you get pathology. You might be told there's nothing wrong, maybe like you've been told before, and you still get drugs. For example, your cholesterol is high, so you need to lower it. Your body is far more complicated than that. Your laboratory numbers are off because your biochemistry and your physiology are not functioning correctly. Your body manages as best it can with what you've done to it. If you're tired and weary of the way it works, then you have to carefully find out what's going on. Let's do what we can to find out what's going on. That's what we will do with your metabolic system. Unwrap it and study it. That's what we'll do with your brain and nervous system. Test it and find out what would improve it. Watch. Next year, you might be right where you are. You might be worse if you don't do something right now. But what would your life be like if you were 30% or 50% better? Do you think that that's a reality for you? Less drugs or none? More energy? Less weight? More health? In no time, I'd release you from active care and you'd be a different person or like you used to be when you were healthier. You probably already know that the next step is to fill out the forms that we've sent you or that you have and get them into us before your first visit. And if you've already done that, you're one step closer to finding out if we can accept you for care. Now, I've given you a lot of helpful information. And as you go through your day, you may think about all these things I've told you. But promise me you'll remember at least these two things. A. You have to find out what's going on neurologically and metabolically. And remember, not pathologically, like how medicine has looked at you and shaken their heads, but functionally, how your body really works and what it needs to become well again. What would that be worth to you? And B, if we can help you, you should realize that it will take time, but I guarantee I will put together for you the best treatment program that we have available and the time to watch your health unfold again. Now here's what we're going to do. You call our office if you haven't, 503-581-6846. Get the two forms filled out and get them in. Well, I hope you now will have a better day with what you've heard. I'm Dr.